Summon Water Village. I wonder if the inhabitants here are mad. Also, just quietly, this doesn't look like a very pleasant village to me. Hell, it looks just like a bunch of ruins rather than a village. These things are the worst. Did I say work is the worst? These things are actually the fucking worst. Come here, you. Fine. Anything this way? We were there not long ago, but it feels like I've done nothing since. I got teleported into that area on in Kalid. Spent ages trying to fight a boss. Failed. And here I am. Okay, so this looks slightly more like a village to me. Have I made a huge mistake? It's those assholes that I need to kill twice. Just kind of mindful of ads here. What are you doing? What are you doing? I have no idea what he just did. Looked like some sort of AoE, but I was well out of range. Alright, where did you go? Sounds like he's ahead of me, but I can't see him. Sounds like he's right here, but I can't see him. Just making sure my earphones aren't in backwards. They're not. For reals, it sounds like he's right here. I saw that glow over there just now. Doing something. They're just fighting with his boat. Oop. As I thought he's summoning these dudes.
where did he... Oh, you fucking went all, all the way back over here again. Okay. okay it's one of these assholes that can spawn these magic ball things. I think I've got that spell. I'll never use it, but I think I've got it. Alright. Die, please. Don't get back up. Yeah, he was spawning all of these things. Death Root and Skeletal Militia Man Ashes. That is another summon that I do not know how to use, but what is this key item, Death Root? A source that gives rise to those who live in death. The beast clergyman found a bestial sanctum in the distant east. We were just there. Collects and devours these roots. On the night of the dire plot, the stolen rune of death enabled the first death of a demigod. Later, the rune of death spread across the lands between through the underground roots of the great tree, sprouting in the form of death roots. I take it I need this for a boss battle at some point. The Gypsy Claw, how are you doing? If you are suggesting to play a certain game, not today. Not tomorrow, not ever. <laughs> or if you want to give me advice on how to take out um, the boss that I was trying to take out earlier, whose name I can't remember, that would be super duper awesome. Oi. Alright, so I took you out, so that gives me something that I can use later on in the distant east. I see it somewhere over here. Probably where all these arrows are pointing to, outside of this tunnel. But right now though, I just want to keep exploring Limgrave. Ooh, okay, we have a shaft of light. I have some direction at last. No, I don't have some direction. Shit. I thought that was actually pointing somewhere. God damn it. Can I do a double jump to survive this fall? Or not take damage? I totally can't. No, I can't. I totally can't do that. Holy fuck. Can't do that. Hey, pigs, how are you doing? Thank you for hanging out, dude. I've been watching you struggle with Uncharted 3 the last couple of days. And I am struggling with frigging Elden Ring right now. God damn it. I thought I'd be able to survive that. You know, at the same way you can survive an elevator drop but just by jumping at the last second. Yeah, the game is too smart for such shenanigans, but then the other day I managed to fall from a great hyphen on cliff, or I fell, fell onto a cliff, the floor crumbled below me, and then I fell from a spectacular height into a bush, and I survived unharmed. So I'm not sure that holds water, to be honest. Right now, though, I just want to find some way down so I can start exploring. I'm thinking head towards that tree. I don't really have any other options in my head at the moment. 
Up oh, here we go. This looks interesting. Gypsy Claw suggests jump out of a plane with a mattress and jump off it right before you hit the ground. I mean, I will admit I did not study that particular scenario in my physics class in year 12, but it sounds plausible. It really sounds plausible. I think the fundamental problem with that theory, though, is that you aren't actually allowed to take a mattress on as hand luggage. So it's a good theory, but unfortunately it won't work in reality. Yeah, where is that area directly ahead of me? Is that Castle Morn? check right now because I'm in combats but it's fine. No, that's not Castle Mort, it's something else. Alright, I think all I'll do is just stuff around here for the rest of the stream. Just gotta find a way down. I think you backstepping there was the right move, buddy. Ash of War. Ash of War. Sacred Blade. Ooh, I wonder if that does holy damage. That could perhaps be another option that I could use for a very difficult boss battle. Okay, where was the third Church of America mentioned? I just need to kill this. You know what? No, I don't. You do whatever you want to do. I'm just going to rest here if that's right. Yeah, this was something about a flask of physic, and I can talk to my maiden at this point. A flask of wondrous physic still remains in the third church of America, north of the Mistwood. The Mistwood is south to us. Cross the highway bridge and follow the animal trail north. Yeah, sure. I completely did that. Uh, sacred tear. Sacred tear. Again, I need one more for the next one. Spoken echoes of Queen Marika linger here as well. Shall I share them with you? Please do. Very well. In Marika's own words, my lord and thy warriors, I divest each of thee of thy grace. With thine eyes dimmed, ye will be driven from the lands between. Ye will wage war in a land afar, where ye will live and die. Well, perhaps that might serve you in lieu of a maiden's guidance. You've told me nothing, Melana. You've told me absolutely nothing. 
Hey pig, so I just saw your message there. Congrats on the plat. Flask of Wondrous Physic. You can find crystal tears at the bases of minor earth trees and elsewhere throughout the lands between. At Sites of Grace, you can mix two crystal tears in the Flask of Wondrous Physic. This will allow you to create elixirs with various custom effects. Wait, it says one of one, so that makes me think that um, I could reuse these, I hope. Alright, so... What have we got here? Restores half a total. Steadily restores. Significantly next gates damage. Temporarily boosts faith. Oh, well, not using that one. It's either that one or that one. I might go for that. And I guess I can now equip this here. Yep, it's already there. Interesting. And the one there makes me think that we're going to find more flasks. Uh, I don't want to know who the creative player was who managed to get up there and leave that message, but whatever. So the Mistwood is to the south. Is going to lead me to, or if I activate that, an invisible dude is going to appear. Hey, yeah, where is what is this? Let me just mark that on the map. I'm not going to use that yet because that's going to probably lead me into a dungeon. Oh, okay, this is very important. Clearly, clearly very important. Grey Beast. Yep, that's where I'm headed. Uh, you right there, buddy? Oh, I can't bear to watch that. This looks suspicious on the map, so is there anything nice here? Apart from, you know, a bunch of lilies. I'm not breathing. Are you going to teleport me? No, good. Are these resources? No. Look at the pretty pink flowers and thinking they are resources, but no, they're not. Oh shit, did not see you there. Alright, I wake you up, which means you or I have to die. And I would much prefer that to be you. Nothing personal, just so. Lambo. I've 
I've never been handled by a bear like that. Just saying. Oh. Right. I'm dodging here, I'm not blocking. Yep, I need to clearly use my torch here. Oh my god. Dude, this bear likes me. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm sort of flattered, but I can't have you killing me accidentally. Still, please. up your gold tinged excrement. Ooh, hefty beast bone. Wonder if we can use that for a slightly more powerful dance or something. Uh, training, what do I train people in? It's kind of complicated, but basically just software usage. Nothing that's specifically on the market, it's just something that we internally use. Specifically how to use it and how to use it with our company's procedures and whatnot. Purple. What is an axe talisman? So power up our axes, enhance the charge attacks, which I rarely use to be honest, so I think I'll skip on that one. But yeah, basically just giving presentations, talking to people, demoing things, just making a fool of myself basically, which is why I'm doing these streams, believe it or not. There's an NPC here. Did I just kill an NPC? Okay, I can hear someone howling. I can definitely hear someone howling, but I don't see anyone around here. Sounds like it's coming directly ahead of me, but I don't see it. In here? No? Ah, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Getting my black belt in ballet. Funny I was that awesome, dude. Okay, I see you. You're all the way up there. I don't think there's a way I can reach you. Yeah, no, I don't have enough time to train in extracurricular activities like that, unfortunately. Hmm. Interesting. I'm talking about the wolf, not ballet. following this path, which takes me to this castle. Come on. I really don't like fighting on horseback. Alright, so I've been told, reliably informed by a scroll, that if I take you out, the rest of them will scatter, but that's not happening. Got my flask back. Nice. 
Alright, so just over this hill. Alright, I ignored one earlier. What do you want? Lord Kenneth has been guarded by blood. Fucking Barbie. Okay, I can already see we've got a uh, blister up there. Which is gunning at these dudes down here, so... I'm going to take a wide berth if that's alright with everyone. Can I get around this way? That is a no. Okay. How about over here? If the answer is also a no, then I think I have to make a run for it up in the middle. Wait. Wait. Do we have a shaft of light pointing us towards that castle? No, he does. Damn, I was really hoping for some guidance, but we're not going to get any. Can we go this way, though? No, we can't. It looks like, uh, unless I'm missing something very obvious, we have to just make our way down the middle. We can definitely give that a go. Alright. Yeah, these opponents seem relatively easy, so... I feel like I might be able to make some progress here. Oh, come on. Some lovely synchronized animations you got going there, buddies. You been practicing? Ooh, we've got a golden seed ahead. At least I think we do. Oh, God. So. Yeah, do that again. Help me out. They are actually in fighting. That's great. I haven't seen that mechanics used that well since Doom 1993. Or whatever year it came out. Golden Seed. Golden Seed. So if there's nothing else in here, it was worth it for that alone. Can't imagine there'd be anything on this side of the castle, but I need to check. Nothing. All right. Let's go indoors. What are we up against? Fort Heights. I think that's how it's pronounced. Wow. Yeah, I'm definitely probably over-leveled for this area. Blood Rose, probably crafting materials. So I'm getting hit from all sides with fire and I'm not dying. Anything down there? Right, Q 
tell me you pick it, but... Anyone else want some? That I can reach. Fucking assholes. Oh, oh, that sword. That's special. Whatever. Uh, I think I know what that is now. Alright. Try that again. It won't work. Ash of War, Bloody Slash. Definitely gonna have to check that one out, as well as the holy one that I picked up. Lord Blood Roses. I've got a horrible feeling there's not much else here. Maybe there's something in that tower, but otherwise, that might actually be it for this area. Telling me this here is a trap? Nope. Someone's just being a troll, I think. Might be something down there. Maybe something over there. I can see someone's left a message, but I'm not sure how to immediately reach that area. I can't imagine there'd be anything valuable over there. Anything inside here? Obligatory, not breathing. Dexus Medallion. Half of a medallion. Join medallions to operate. Ah, oh, someone mentioned that. We'll activate the Grand Lift of Dexus, collecting the At Altus Plateau to Lernia. Okay, I think that was mentioned by someone. Why is the sword mentioned clipping through the cape? It's a special cape. Um, I think that was mentioned by someone over here, near this bridge. I recall going north. It was mentioned by you. I think you mentioned the Grand Lift. I don't know if you, if I recall you saying something about something that needs to be put together like that. Oh wow, all of that is Eastern Limgrave as well. Maybe that is my next port of call. Uh, but it mentions something about far to the east, so maybe it's all the way over here, or... It's probably a lot further over to the east, isn't it? It's probably a lot further over. I really do wonder, though, if that is a critical key item that we need to pick up to actually complete the game. Like, whether it unlocks half of the map or something, please don't answer that if that is the case. Um, or whether it's optional. Nice. I don't think there's anything else here. Alright, let me head back to the side of Grace, which should be directly ahead. Let me just play with these Ashes of War. Just marking some more interesting areas on the map. I may also take a look at that. That is also going to be a um, boss battle, isn't it? Which may or may not give me something useful. 
For now, though, I want to go back and pass by the tree that I missed. So there may be another avatar or whatever it is. I can't climb down there. Fuck it, I'll just teleport. Um, I want to go back to the tree and see if there's an avatar there. And then I just want to check out the other areas on the map, including that jail, because I do have a key on me. How many runes do I have? Almost enough. Yeah, holy damage. I mean, I've got nothing in the way of intelligence, faith, or arcane, but I'm kind of inclined just to try that out to see what it does. We have magic, we have that. That's interesting. Blood doesn't appear to do much. All it does is it puts the property of Coil's blood loss build up down the bottom right as a passive effect. Let me try that though. I want to see how that goes. Holy damage. Holy Essence and fires off a golden blade projector. The armament retains its holy essence for a while. Ooh. Interesting. So I cleared out this castle, sir. Do you have anything new to say? Jesus Christ. No, nothing. What is with that in here, though? This looks strange. Oh. Maddox's merchant is here, so he must be either nearby or he must come back at a certain point. You've never spoken to me like that before, so I'm suspicious. Welcome. Trade in our wandering emporium. Please, buy something. I'm hungry. I've been hungry so long. Please? You don't have any keys for sale. Uh, I'm thinking of picking that up purely because it does 100 physical. Purchase size as well, even though I'll probably never use them. Uh, nothing else for me, thank you. You sell bolts? You do sell bolts. Fuck it. Alright, how do we reach this tree? It's above me. Ah, uh, definitely not that way. Gypsy Claw says, don't drink and drive, kids. Take acid and teleport instead. I mean, teleporters are a thing in the world of Elden Ring, so I think it's sage advice.
Alright, do we have another avatar around here? We have lots of opportunities to replenish our flasks. But that... Another key item in the form of a spiked crack tier and green spill crystal tier. I assume that two of those, correction, one of those, is for our physic flask. No, they both are. Never mind. Enhances charge attacks. No. Temporarily boosts stamina. Ooh. Could be very useful in boss battles. Uh, you know what? You can you can live. Is there a boss around here? Oh, I don't see a boss around here. Spliff and scroll time. You do you, sir. I think I tr I think I read one of the Discworld novels many many years ago, and yeah, I think I would have enjoyed it more if I was on drugs. Over here. I can't pronounce that. Something river well. Is that gonna take me down? Oh, so much from visiting this area here. I've been distracted. Uh this is a long way down. That is a fucking long way down. Whoa. What have I just walked into? This game seemed large enough without throwing this at me. Uh, is it just dark because we're underground now, or what? Wait, I can't teleport. I can't teleport back up. My waifu is not here to tell me anything. I think someone did mention, uh, one of the NPCs, something about going underground or traversing underground at the roots of the Great Tree, perhaps. I was not expecting this, however. Jukis Turbo. So it's still classed as outdoors, which is interesting. Kind of worried though that we haven't run into anyone yet. Okay, never mind. Um, how many hit points do you have? Ah! Uh, whoa! Went straight through my guard. this. Oh. 
police. They're not hard, but they just hit hard, and because they're all gathered in a group like that, they're kind of hard to kill. They don't stun easily. What about inside the building there? And they don't give me many runes, 252, so I think I'll pass on that direction for now. Well, shit. <laughs> um, okay. One twenty each. That's not good. Dude, the range of my spears is ridiculous. I'm not getting any kind of stun from that um, guard cancer. Which sucks. The Ash of War is actually making a huge difference to my DPS though, which is interesting. And it's also lasting quite a long amount of time. About 30 seconds or so. For reals, is there anything useful down here? Actually, gave me back my flasks. Okay. Nice. Shit, there's so many of them. Dude. If I'm going to be using the um, Ash of War, I think it's almost time that I start considering putting a couple of uh, Cerulean Tear Flasks in my setup. Uh, what the fuck are you doing? You're blowing bubbles. I love blowing bubbles. Just, you know, not in freaking video games. Bathtubs, yes. In Elden Ring, no. So, that looks like just the other side of where we fought those other dudes and died in spectacular fashion. There's nothing in this little nook here. 
No. Okay. So we're either fighting six at once or going through that building there where we fight a few at once. Oh dear. I wasn't expecting that. I need to get out of here now. Okay, this game officially sucks because there is nothing behind the waterfall. Can't do that. Alright. Where are we going? It looks like, relatively speaking, we're going to an island. No, never mind. I have no fucking idea where we are. We're just slightly above where we just were. I'm certain that all of these are trolls. They just want you to praise a message so that they can get up votes. And the way they're doing it is by saying, oh, you'll get a treasure chest for doing it. And they're all lies. Uh, nope, not even once. No map, no map. Another side of grace. Look at this place. The fact that I can't even see the, um, the sky is really doing my head in. And yeah, I don't see a way out of here other than to teleport back here and take the lift back up to the tree. I was really hoping though that there will be a map here. Light flame. Ah, uh, did that do anything significant? Other than acting as a marker, however, to say that someone was here and that someone is invading the place, I'm not sure that that accomplished any useful purpose. So the map was on a random NPC here, rather than um, at one of the guidestones, or whatever you want to call it. Okay, so it doesn't look like a terribly large area. This might just be a dungeon. This might just be a massive dun- or well, not a massive dungeon, but a larger than average dungeon with a boss at the end here, perhaps. Your boss. Look at this place, though. This is terrifying. I mean, it's beautiful and terrifying. Like a hallowed hole all the way up there. 